Hello everyone. Today, we will explore how to integrate a bootstrap menu into a WordPress website. Many individuals who develop websites using WordPress often wonder how they can incorporate a bootstrap menu. In this video, I will demonstrate the step-by-step -step process of adding a bootstrap menu to a WordPress site. WordPress is a popular platform for website development and bootstrap is a widely used front-end framework. Combining the power of both can enhance the design and functionality of your website. To start, ensure that you have a functioning WordPress site. We need to include the required Bootstrap CSS and JS files. Now, we will include the WP Bootstrap Navwalker library from GitHub into our WordPress site. Firstly, let's create a class file within WordPress to house the relevant code. Inside the mon folder, create a new PHP file and name it class WP Bootstrap Navwalker.php. Next, visit GitHub and search for WP Bootstrap Navwalker. This library provides a custom nav walker class that extends the WordPress walker nav menu class, enabling the bootstrap navigation menu functionality in WordPress. Once you locate the repository, open the WP bootstrap navwalker.php file. Copy all the code from the GitHub file and paste it into the WP bootstrap navwalker.php file you created within your WordPress themes folder. Now, let's update the functions. Register nav, hp file with the code we copied from GitHub. We'll use the function register navwalker and the add action after setup theme, register navwalker, code. Now, before using the WP nav menu function, let's copy the necessary code for the Bootstrap navbar container and toggle button from the Bootstrap website. Visit the Bootstrap website and navigate to the navbar section. Locate the HTML code for the navbar container and the toggle button. Copy both sections. Open the header.php file in your WordPress themes directory. Find the appropriate location where you want to insert the navbar container and toggle button code. Paste the copied code into the header.php file. Ensure that the navbar container code is wrapped in element. This element represents the navigation section in HTML. Now, let's copy the sample WP nav menu function code from GitHub and paste it into the appropriate location in the header.php file. Please note that we will update the theme location and container id values later. Open the header.php file in your WordPress themes directory. Locate the section where you want to insert the menu code. Now, let's register a menu using the register nav menus function. Afterwards, we can add some links to the header menu from the WordPress admin panel. Finally, we will update the theme location value in the WP nav menu function to header menu. Now, let's update the data BS target attribute value within the nav element in the header.php file. Replace the existing ID value with the desired ID for the menu container. Now, let's add the code snippet that enables the walker to use the infix data attribute for dropdown toggles. Copy the code and paste it into your functions.php file. Please note that the provided links are placeholders and you should replace them with the actual links to your code resources. Congratulations on successfully implementing a bootstrap menu into your WordPress site. If you have any further questions or need additional assistance, feel free to ask. Happy coding!
Thank you for choosing this tutorial.